In this first clip, you are going to be watching a disrespectful employee confront a parent whose daughter was trying on pants in the open while she had leggings on. Wait for it. She did not change her clothes. She was horrified. She was she was the look on her face right. when she looked at me. Don't I don't tell me how my daughter was. My daughter was completely fine. She said, can I just stand right here? You think that having a child can't get down to changing clothes in public is okay for your child? I have to She think was in horrible. leggings. Do you know it what leggings are? are? Do you know what leggings are? All right, ma'am. You work are you here? Stupid? Do you know what leggings are? Are you stupid? Why are you acting? Act stupid? You are acting stupid. You're talking to your employees like my daughter was back there. She was. No, she, she was, was not. But she she was in leggings and changing clothes. She was in leggings not and a sweater. Not she tried on a pair of not pants over her pants. Not appropriate. That is appropriate. Not appropriate. How is that appropriate? Have you seen the people that shop in this store? The skeezy men that shop I in this store? I don't care. The women she was in leggings and a sweater. You're exposing leggings your child to skeezy people? Leggings that my child to anything. Yeah. Yeah. Not talking about my parenting. Yeah. I was not exposing my That was, yeah. That was not it a good call. It absolutely is not. not I am a good parent. I don't even know. Your opinion means nothing. Not a good call. I'm just telling you. If my she was not out there, there you because you're talking to all me. your employees about it, I, I do, watched you. I do teach so, them how to handle She was not situation. naked. She was in leggings. Yeah. She was up here. I don't need you yelling. I will be calling her friend. I don't need you yelling. I will be calling her friend. And I will let you know that you had your daughter changing her clothes on the floor. This employee was completely out of line. Did you all notice how she chased the parent out to continue yelling? Now that was a wow moment. But on the lighter mode, she was fired, including the female security. If you have any problem with the easement, the HOA lawyers and our lawyers are taking care of it. So you don't have to be poking me every time and harassing me in my property. God damn! This HOA representative thinks that she has a right to trespass on a resident's property because of an easement issue that they have. Take a listen to the conversation between the property owner and the HOA representative. Watch this. You're trespassing in my property and you've really been so rude about it. I've seen you like every other day. So go talk to your lawyer and please, for the last warning, do not step in this property. If you have any problem with the easement, the HOA lawyers and our lawyers are taking care of it. So you don't have to be poking me every time and harassing me in my property. This is a two million property, correct? Okay. You guys have really harassed me. I don't know if it's racism or what. I'm the only black person here with the most expensive house. I have no idea. Can you imagine if I came to your property and just entered in the gate like that? without permission what will you do to me ma'am so again this is the last warning you can take a video and tell whoever you want to say the attorneys are taking care of the easement situation you don't have to be coming here personally every time whenever i show up or whenever my visitors come okay that's harassment I check the signs every day. Yes, That's it's okay. It's your job, but you don't have to be coming through the gate. The gate, This is. it's okay. Property. Yes, until the attorneys decide that. We have an attorney taking care of this case. So ma'am, I'm giving you the last warning. Do not trespass in my property. I'm closing the gate, so step out. Step out. And you should not ever harass again my visitors. You've sabotaged my property. It's been six months without selling. This case of the easement, has both attorneys taking care of correct your hoa attorney is working with my attorney so there's no reason why you should be coming every day to harass me in my property okay so go check the email the attorney wrote the other day to your attorney so do not again do not step in my property anymore you do you do that every day okay it's a gated it's gated, so do not enter here again, ma'am. These are many other reasons are why a lot of people would never buy property in a HOA community. But on the other hand, if you were the property owner, how would you have addressed this situation with this Karen? Let me know in the comment section. 
In this upcoming clip, you are going to be watching a tenant who is three months behind in his rent, claiming to being harassed or threatened by his landlord, who allegedly came into his house unannounced. Take a look at this drama. The first very thing he says is that I came into his house without notifying. You unlocked my door. What? Yes, we you, left a note on your right, door this, yesterday. You, you pulled, unlocked my you door. Pulled, you you have no, no you right to do that. You pulled the note off the door saying that we would be here today, right? You have no right to do that. That's very inappropriate. I'm pretty we sure. I am pretty notice. sure that is not what a landlord's supposed not to do. Well, you you do not have a landlord a right. Do. You do not have a you right. Being confrontational. You basically John, broke into my house. You basically I, I broke into my yeah, house. I will have clean. August. What? You said the batteries. I will have oh, no. August. But you should. No, I'm no, I will not shut up in my house John, because I'm it's trying not to. your house. It's your, John, I am trying to tell you guys that I will have August John, month's rent John, for you today. Just I'm going to doing. go and grab my. I'm going to grab my check today. Okay. You're being very hostile. This is you, very inappropriate. Well, and this is typical of you. Oh, typical of me? Yes. What yes. am I doing? John, I have you on camera, dude. Do I have you all on camera. Uh, like I'm so I have scared you. or something? I don't care. Right, if okay, you're then. scared, okay. you're still getting yeah, in my face, still walking towards me. Place. We pay the maintenance for this place. And, and look, we gave you a notice on and, the door and written. And and you I guys have you basically been phone. harassing me. Who, what's your harassment for breaking this stuff? John, take your pictures. No, you can't. Don't argue. He's just, he's, he's, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you I am. Away, I, I, I am, I am threatened. Yeah, won't change like, anything. So, you want to get so just take phone? the pictures. Being very You're inappropriate. You're in the right unless you yell at him. What? We are in the right unless you yell at him. Right? I so have, just take I pictures. have all this on camera. This is. Right, that's fine. Just take the damn pictures and can we go? Please let me do it. Don't argue. You are I, making I, this I, I, worse. You, you are making this a lot worse than what this insane. needs to be. The longer you talk, the more No, the the more you decide to do what you want to do is we gonna take right. long. No, you had a notice. Yeah, and I understand yeah. that, but no, you still yeah. have no right to come into on my house. The door. And you said nothing. Therefore, I was up, the I was getting up to Did answer the anything? door. Did I don't say... need to say anything, bro. Well, who knows you, that you're I do not anything. need to say a thing to you. No. I was here too. I heard him not only knock but announce himself. And? I did. I was right there. I heard it. It doesn't matter. You, you uh, don't have a right. We own yeah, laugh. Property you're, right you're, here, you're... And you haven't paid rent for three months, so you know. The the same thing late. I've been uh, telling you this whole time. The garbage has the not been same thing I have been Take telling you. Take the picture so we can go. This is why I record you every time you come yeah. into my home yeah. because John. you th so you is, you're basically camera? very threatening. You're threatening. You are threatening. You don't pay the rent. You break oh, really? my house. Really? You break my stove. I. I, I did not break down. I told you. You didn't that. say anything when you signed. You do the, not listen. You didn't say anything. You do not listen. You didn't say anything when I've explained when, everything no, to no, you. No, I've no, been no. very fair to you. The camera's not working so much. Then let's come back another time. Let us in another time. I, it's not true. Look at yeah, yourself. I'm giving you notice right look now at yourself. on your camera that we'll be back tomorrow to take those pictures. Right. Let's okay, go. that is fine. But right. the way right. he's acting right now is inappropriate. And you are an. And I'm an idiot. Right. Look at yourself. Go take a look, a long look in the mirror, John. Go at take a age, long look. It's gonna change in the mirror. Learn to be wise, will you? Y'all need to learn to be wise, okay? The law is on our side, John. Look, get oh. out of there. Oh, oh, John. Oh, oh. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. And also the third. Oh. Minute, the 30th of oh. September was the end of the period oh. that we could evict you. So oh. th that hole in the wall oh. will be fixed. Oh. Yeah. Oh. John, let's okay. Go. We'll have to Look at you. Look at you. I will be sending this to the police. Thanks, John. You did yourself 
some justice. First of all, tenants like this, they are infuriating. Secondly, dude, you are three months behind in your rent and you're claiming that you've been threatened? Come on, man. Pay up or move out of their property. Unbelievable. Please take your time to watch this clip of a paraplegic man who was wrongfully arrested. Initially, I thought this was just a joke. But actually, this incident happened in Maryland. Take a look at this. Uh, Lenny, how are, you can come out and so I can I'm paralyzed, huh? I, I understand, and I, I saw that, and that's why I'm asking, you know. Yeah, you can talk to me. So, I, I mean, I'll need to uh, for you to come out so I can talk to you. Yeah, no problem, bro. All right? Huh? Yeah. I'll need you to come out so I can talk no to you. No problem. All right. Yeah. I'm paralyzed. I have to. I understand. I understand. You, you want me to just, just jump out? Grab, uh, on, grab my arm. Grab me out. Come on. No, I'll need you to come Babe. to the back of the vehicle so I can talk to you. So. Help me out. I will help. You want me my help? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, hold on, I got you. Come on. Come on, you gotta yeah, hold I got you. I got you. I'm paralyzed. You gotta hold on. I got you. I got you. He can't. Oh, I, I got you. He can't walk. I got you. Gotta hold your hold your feet. I can't. I, I'm paralyzed. Right. You gonna drag me? Sir, do you need He he paralyzed. He can't walk. He can't walk. He's you a have a, like a, he's, a, a, par he's a paraplegic. That's the only thing you have? This how you this how you uh, sit, sit right here real quick. Sit right here. You gonna, you gonna set me outside on the ground? Nah, well, I'm, I'm gonna Why try you, to hold you. Why are you setting me on the ground, oh, man? Wow, this is know. crazy. Why y'all setting me on the ground, Ready? dude? Yeah. We're gonna try to help you out, man. Yeah, but why you I, just. I can't, I'm paralyzed, bro. Okay. You know what paralyzed me? Uh, let's see. I'm got a wheelchair, bro. I'm paralyzed. Do you have a uh, wheelchair? Yeah. All it's right, on so. his back. Ma'am, can you help with the wheelchair? Yeah, that's what I was trying to tell y'all. I have to get his wheelchair out in the back. Well, that's how I asked him first. you have your camera on? All right. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes, yes I do. How you want to get me? Sorry, sir. All right. Just hold right there, sir. Okay? Man, I, I have this. This could have been a little easier, you guys. How you going to get me? You got me going out? Yeah. All right. Come on, let's go. I can't, I'm paralyzed, man. I just sit right here tight, okay, sir? I do apologize for the You know what I mean? This up. You know why I got my wheelchair in the back? Yeah, my wheelchair's in the back. You know why I got right. sir? You know why I Because you can talk to a person and you can figure out how you can do things better. Where sir, is your I camera? Ask you. Can I see where your camera's at? The camera's in the car, in the vehicle. So nobody have a camera on? What's your That's name, sir? What's your badge name? What's your badge number? 1737. 1737? Office Affiliates. Office Service Affiliates? Right, that thanks. is correct, sir. What's your Corporate. Um, badge? Corporate Harris ID 1640. Corporate Harris ID 1640. All right. We cool. The, the, oh, yeah. Why are you talking about the. You all right? No, 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 sir. Oh, no, oh, not at all. Man. Hey, all right. you okay? You good, man? He's starting to scare all right. For what? No reason. Can you my wife get my wheelchair? Yes. That's why I asked Get my wheelchair from the bed? I just asked her for assistance, sir. Yeah. All, right. All right. So where y'all? What's going on? What's with going me? on? We we need to know I'm because I'm about to be arrested. Well, so, well, basically, there's kids over here. It's private information between you and I, so we have to. But I'm, 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 I'm my I'm my I'm my husband caregiver, so I, I, I need to know what's going on too. Let's get the wheelchair for you. Let me see that for you. Okay. Who did you say your um, badge number your name is? Oh, sir, I feel it's ID 1737. All right. Thank okay. you, sir. All right. I just think y'all can do things better. You, you know, you don't just drag a man. I didn't drag, I didn't drag you out, sir. I asked you, and you, know. you asked for my assistant, and I try to help you. Your body is bigger but than my body. If I'm, and try you to that, drag. if I'm telling you that I'm paralyzed, but you could you constantly saying I need to come out. No, I said no, I say I ask, you asked me for assistant and I'm asking you need my assistant, you say I need to grab you. I say I can't grab you because there's no reason I'm gonna grab you and pull you out of the vehicle just yeah. like that. No. It'll you know be a I lot mean? of money, you know what I mean? Y'all gonna have to yeah. do. Yeah, I mean what I'm saying is uh, sir, 
You just threw trash over there, man. Uh, You're littering, man. You're not supposed to litter. You're okay, not supposed to litter, sir. There's some more important things yeah. currently, okay, yeah. sir? You're not supposed to litter, man. That's crazy, man. So what's going on with me? Huh? Um, oh, yes, it's, it's not an extra dynamo, so... Um, uh, based on that information, I will talk to you. Okay, when you get on your wheelchair, we'll talk, and it, I'll talk to you. Am I being arrested? Um, as far as that information, like I said, as far as what? everybody is concerned, right? This is my family. And, I'm, and, I'm and married. I, I'm, Am I being I'm a arrested? married man as well. Am and I being I'm, arrested? Listen. Ah, uh, yes? For what? Uh, Tell me now, sir. Huh? What am I being arrested we'll, for? We'll talk. We'll, sir, I, you, we'll, we'll, I, we'll talk. We'll, we'll talk. I, I need to know father, now. As a father that's yeah, yeah, in the car, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, privacy if, for you. If you was talking as privacy, a father, you, you know, talking I'll as a, talk to you and If you was talking as a father, you would know that uh, for a brake light, man, you, you, you come behind me for a brake light. I told you that I was evacuating uh, from a storm. Well, I do that's some but listen, sir. Oh man. Once I make connection with you, why I stop you? It is our duty so, to so inform no, you to so, provide so you I'm the going proper to jail information. Right now. I'm going to jail right now. Okay. Am I going to jail, sir? Am I being arrested, sir? I'm asking your question. You. We'll, we'll talk. I need to know now, man. Once Am I you, being arrested? She, she's getting that wheelchair. <laughs> we'll have a talk, okay, in private. Okay, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Hey, go, sir. Wait, he, he said you have a warrant in North Carolina. You, they about to bring you to jail. I've never been to North Carolina. I've never been to North Carolina. Yo, hold that, man. That's cool. I've never been to North Carolina. I don't have no warrants. You got the right person? I've never been to North Carolina in my life. Never in my life. So, maybe this is all wrong. But if that's what you're saying, we're going to go to North Carolina. He's saying he's a as far That's how I told you. When I get over here, I'll talk to you and explain about the information. Okay? All right? And I, get, I, I need diapers and stuff. I, I, need, I, I don't have no Let's control. get you out of there for safety, okay, sir? All right. All right? Let's go right here, ma'am. Please. Okay? I'm about to sign you around here. I don't have a woman he, he just, the other officer just explained, explained okay. to me that my... Sir, okay, hey, sir, no can you listen, can you listen, can you listen, can you listen? Uh, it's in Georgia that you have it's kind of started it basically is it's basically what they did, okay? And they figured the action is going on, and they said they would to exercise. They told me to actually arrest you, bring it to Central Bank, and then they will send somebody to you again. Okay. All right? So I'm just explaining everything because I just want to make sure it's privately between both of you guys. We have the case of what's going on. If she decides to explain the case, then that's okay. But my goal is to. So, so he's a paraplegic. He wore diapers. He have to self catch. So, like, what do y'all want him to do? Without me. Where my catheter is this stuff? Basically, you you in Maryland and Charles County right now. Okay. So basically, we have to talk to make arrangements. Okay. So you can get to the over there. So when I drop you to Charles County, and then it's there. Okay. So I can get to the arrangement. It's a process. It's gonna be it, it, it's a long process, especially him being a paraplegic. Like this is crazy to me. I truly really apologize, but we it's have to follow protocol. Yeah. But we have to follow protocol. Okay. That's the only reason it took so long. Okay. So what am I supposed to do? Cause I'm I'm his caregiver. Like I'm his wife. I'm his caregiver. I take care of him. I do everything for him. I so we do. Basically, uh, what I, I have, have no to control do, of my bowels. I have to bring him to Charles County. Yeah, well, I need to be okay. cool. So where is George County? Charles County is about. I have no control of my bowels. Is that in is that in Maryland? Yeah, that's, we're in Maryland. Yeah, I know this is Maryland. Here, it's like right in Waldo. 
it's and gonna then be a lot of money. Over here, over there. So okay, basically, what will be happening? It will be. Um, it's, like, they probably gonna call hold him, him or you up. probably have to wait over there. Oh, I'm not sure what arrangement you will be able to make. So I'm just informing you what will be happening. Well, because they have. Well, well, can we get the price of the window? Okay, that's absolutely. Here in the All right, so uh, believe me, I, I have to explain to you as you request information, right? right? Okay, okay, just just, just right. go straight by in. All right, so I have to follow. Okay. All right, y'all have to put y'all have to put the cup. A few moments later. Currently asking. Okay. Right here, right here, okay? I, just to make sure. I know your hands big. That's why I, I just want to make sure. Okay. Okay. All right. People not coming to get you. Huh? People not coming to get you. Okay. I'll do that. That's possibly much easier. Oh, no, I'm just, uh, I'm just uh, it's, it's a policy that we have to follow. You know what I'm saying? No, I, not at all. Believe me. This is really, really sad. And I'm lost for words on this one. I cannot believe that after those officers found out that this guy is on the wheelchair they still arrested him i think both officers should be fired on the spot period finally on this episode of karen's in the wild we've got drama at one of the mcdonald's drive through take a look at this are you are you the one i was talking to in the microphone Okay, I was just letting you, I was letting you know that there was something going on with your sensor back there because you got like five empl five customers that's passed us. Yeah, we and have great like, people in here. I, I understand that, but you ain't got to be rude when somebody addresses a situation about that's very unprofessional. What 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 is your name? What is your name, ma'am? What is your name? No, I'm here to take my meal because I've done it wrong. I'm asking you a simple question, and you're getting mad with the customer. I'm not being rude. I'm asking your name, ma'am. What what is your name, ma'am? My name is Leslie. Leslie, what, ma'am? You work for McDonald's. I will be giving corporate a call. I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell. Right, let me tell you. <laughs> we don't care. I, exactly. What what is your name? I just told Leslie, what? No, I just need to get my food that I'm here to pay for. So you're refusing to give me my food that I pay for. You're refusing to give me my food. You refuse. Oh, now you want to take my money. Are you refusing my order, Leslie? No. Nope. Bro, go home and cook your own meal. It's not that deep.